In New York City tonight, news on two NYPD officers shot and wounded while chasing a robbery suspect. One shot in the chest, saved by his bulletproof vest. And what authorities have now revealed about the suspect, a migrant from Venezuela. Here's our senior investigative correspondent, Aaron Kutursky. Tonight, these two young New York City police officers are out of the hospital and lucky to be alive after they were shot by a migrant wanted for robbery in Queens. This is a bullet hole. Because of this vest, a young police officer is going home. Officers Richard Yaruso and Christopher Abreu, both 26, were shot just before 2 a.m. while searching for suspects in a string of robberies by thieves on scooters. They observed a male suspect drive a moped the wrong way and attempted to pull him over. The suspect then fled on foot. Police sources told ABC News the officers wrestled the suspect to the ground. They were all within inches of one another when the suspect pulled a gun out of a fanny pack and fired. One is confirmed shot in the leg and one in the vest. We have one perp that's shot. Officer Yaruso trying to stop his partner from bleeding. The one police officer shot in the vest was more concerned about his partner saving his life, getting a tourniquet. Detectives recovered this illegal handgun at the scene and arrested Bernardo Mata, a 19-year-old from Venezuela who entered the U.S. illegally a year ago and had been living in a migrant shelter. David, this suspect is wanted in connection with multiple robberies in Queens. He was shot in the leg with the altercation with the officers. Tonight, he's in the hospital awaiting charges. David? Aaron Katursky here in New York. Thanks, Aaron.